L.A.'s east side celebrates the opening of its largest park space to date. Gil Reyes reports from Ascot Hills Park in El Sereno. Native American dancers celebrate the opening of the east side's largest public playground. In all, 93 acres of open space on the hills of El Sereno. And when you go up to the very top and you get the 360 degree view of Los Angeles, Pasadena, Long Beach, Santa Monica, and, and the San Gabriel, it's just fantastic. Ascot Hills Park officially opens for the summer hiking season with new trails. I'm walking on one right now, 300 new trees, new bathrooms not too far away from here, and this all new outdoor amphitheater. And you remember, uh, there were people that wanted to build condos up here. <laughs> if open space is important uh, in on the west side and in other parts of the city, it ought to be important here too. Mayor Antonio Villaraigosa helped to secure $3 million in state funds to turn this former DWP site into a public park. That was back in 2004 when he served as city councilman. Five years later, renovations stalled because of budget problems, but city and community leaders kept at it. Many people were involved, not only from the beginning getting the petitions, but throughout the project. When the state froze the money, you were there urging the city to find the money to make it move forward. We did that. A blessing for locals like Rebecca Rosales. Sit, relax, clear my mind, uh, especially with the daily stress of the city. You know, you need to... Get in touch with nature. For city leaders, 93 acres isn't enough. They plan to add even more acreage with a children's nature center within two years. At Ascot Hills Park in El Sereno, Gil Reyes for LA This Week. Before the opening of Ascot Hills Park, the east side's largest open space was a nearby cemetery.